One day, our daughter came home with a solar-powered audio Bible called The Treasure. After listening to it for a while, she accepted Jesus into her heart. She was the only Christian in our entire village. We were upset that she had become a Christian. We were devout Buddhists. We didn't understand why she had turned away from her Buddhist faith. She would play the treasure and we would hear it. The words of the Bible softened our hearts. And after a few months, my wife and I both became Christians, along with the rest of our children. When the monk leader of our village heard that we have become Christians, he came to our house and told us if we were to renounce Jesus and come back to Buddhism, everything would be okay. But we refused. We told him we had found the one true God. The next night, the monk brought us in front of the entire village. He asked our family what God we serve. Our daughter stood up and said, we serve the living God. But the monk stopped her before she could continue and sent us away. The following day, we noticed trucks leaving piles of rocks all around our house and we did not know why. Someone had told us it was to repair the roads, but at that night, we truly found out why. At 8 o'clock p.m., the first rock was thrown. The rock flew through our window and landed on the floor. Then another, then another. The monk gathered over 400 people from our village, someone from each household, to stone our house and to kill us. For four hours this continued. My wife and I huddled around our children and prayed to God to protect us. We could hear the villagers yelling at us from outside, if your God is so great, then he will save you. The next morning, we could hear the villagers shouting, did your God save you? As they were laughing, they came back ready to drag out our bodies. But when we heard them, my wife and I and our children walked out. They couldn't believe that we had survived. The monk was furious and he cast our family from the village. He said they would kill us if we ever returned. Now, even the villagers that tried to kill us are curious about this Jesus that saved us. We share with them the love of Christ, and many have accepted Christ into their own hearts. Our family and others that have chosen to follow Christ and listen to the treasure. It gives us hope and the strength to stand up for what we believe in.